SKT versus CJ Inter's 2015 playoffs. This was a series that Marins, Maokai, TP to stall the mini wave to keep CJ from ending. Seems we missed a lot of semifinals games. Quickly overshadowed by the upset of EDG versus SKT only a month later. That said, it's one of the most entertaining best fives I've ever seen. Well, astonishing that Pedro didn't know about it. Ashi Kang is one of her personal favorites. After watching Ban play the series, it made her really admire him. CJ... Maybe we start here then. Fuck it. Is this the new map? It is the new map. Look at them. Maybe we start here. I don't even... I've never seen this series. Is this a series where Faker subbed in? Or is it just easy? Yeah, Faker subbed in. Damn. Okay, we'll watch this. Fuck it. We'll watch that. Okay, we'll start at 2015 and go, and go up to 2023. All Worlds teams win rate at Worlds during their Worlds winning year. Their win rate... Wow, SKT lost one game in 2015. Who was the two chat? Who was the one game they lost to? SKT 2015. It was... Uh, Samsung won one? No, not Samsung. Koo, Koo, sorry? Oh yeah, the Koo Tigers won one game in the finals. Damn, DRX has a pretty decent win rate, all things considered, how many games they played. I think I found Hillisang from a parallel universe where he became a chef and is now actually cooking. Wait, what the fuck? That does look like Hillisang. Wait, that does look like Hilly. That does look like Hilly. MSI 2024 will be held from May 1st to May 19th in Chengdu, China. Pog, let's go, man. The Chengdu Financial Let's City Performing the... Arts Center will host the tournament. <clears throat> is it how many seats is it? A cut fit for the Red King. Okay. Twelve thousand seats. Nice. League of Legends players, what they're good at? Good shot calling, good CS, good hands, good morning. Would you like some six dollar Starbucks hot water with a croissant? Okay. Okay. That's just alright. Maybe give K-Corp a W there. They have the most views on their matches this spring split. K-Corp viewership's always pretty good, yeah. K-Corp viewership's always really high. <clears throat> I think they've created a good narrative. Where all the French fans want K-Corp to win and everyone else just wants to see them lose by the looks of it. Like, people just tune in and see K-Corp lose. VCS is going to continue. However, it's going to be six teams playoffs like before. There's only going to be four teams. With some of their players currently being in investigation, trying to get further proof, the VCS allowed teams to get players on to have the amount to play. Okay, so they're going to continue the VCS with four teams for playoffs, and any player under investigation is. Why is Little Bro sinning working during Good Friday? You should be commemorated the crucifixion of Jesus Christ and his death at Calvary. Who? What are you on about there? Who's Calvary? I'm a sinner. Bro, I've known I'm a sinner for the last like eight years. LS called me a sinner when I bought items. I know I'm a sinner. I like Rennington Topper. KC has a lot of viewership because Kameto doesn't coach him other matches while you and Ibai do. Hmm. People are betting on the number of players to be banned in VCS. It's said to be 16.5. Wait, people are betting how many people get banned? <laughs> what the hell? The contrast between FPX and K-Corp. It might be reaching, but Milky Way is their current star jungle in the LPL and is similar to Bo when he was in the league. These two players joined pretty down teams and respective time managed to take them pretty far. So how is it there's such a contrast between these players? Milky Way is performing good right now because... Yo, what do you mean, bro? Milky Way's team's pretty good. I didn't see their last few series. I didn't see their last few series, but Dogtam and Life are mega flexible to support him. And um, what is Care Champion Pool? Does it facilitate carry junglers really well? A lot of Nico, a lot of Karma, a lot of Ari, a lot of Annie. It's perfect for carry junglers. This team has like really good drafts around him. Like Doctam and Life play everything. Look at this. This is just this split alone. Senna, Varus, Zeri, Ezreal, Kaisa, Fidel, Zaya, Swain, Ash, Jinx, Smolder, MF, TF, Kalista, Kate, and Lucian. Like they'll play Rumble support, also great for AD junglers. Um, so yeah, I think Bo's team had, what, three losing lanes most of the time. Like, they, they, they weren't really that flexible. Two things I wish Kajal would take into consideration. 
A little less shouting and screaming and a little bit more analysis. Screaming and shouting can be fun in some cases, but I think Pele is a brilliant analysis. He's so good at events breakdown concept. I don't mind him streaming personnel, but I want his persevere as identity to be more blunt about players' performances. Some schedule behaves too mild in a diplomatic way. I don't want him to flame players or anything. But I don't I care about his honest opinion about players and coaches. Um do you wanna just do you wanna take over the stream? Do you wanna just do you want me to just do you want me to just comment the stream key and then you want you wanna do it too? Bro, it's it, it's really hard to like analyze and it's really hard to analyze games with no stakes. A best of one, a regular season best of three. It's the only reason I try to be a bit more like involved emotionally. And like actually it's because I'm more of like a fan POV. You know, the game doesn't mean anything. It's just complete shit fest. Analysis is important to me when the game's like really, really important, like really close. Fanatic Jun. Hello, bitch. Hey, hey, what the hey, fuck, Jun? Hey, 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 Jun. Hey, yeah, you need Jun just bitched it. XDD? What is this? To the next. Cost a little time to bring up the cash on screen for Look at this guy, bro. Billionaire, but can't even uh, sub and support the small streamer, bro. Have a couple of <laughs> uh, yeah, I went to this chat and I wrote XDD. His XDD emote is the simple emote. A billionaire can't support small streamer. I did tier one. I did drop hey, a tier one. I did drop a tier one sub. I did. I did my drilla. I dropped a tier one sub. I did. Slash user own a pixel. Marasaka, you don't even follow the channel. Support a small streamer, man. I'm tier one subbed for one month. This guy, man. This guy. I can't. Gets 100k viewers and then doesn't uh, doesn't care about anyone anymore. This guy is caught. LCK's casters predictions for the LCK playoffs. HLE versus KDF. They think HLE is going to win. KT versus DK. They think KT is going to win. Then they think HLE is going to beat T1. Gen G is going to beat KT. It's going to be T1 versus KT. Then Hamalife is going to beat Gen G. No, Hamalife is going to lose and play against T1. And then it's going to be Gen G, T1 in the finals, and it's 3 0. And that's wrong. That's wrong. Let me let me show you where you went wrong here. Let me show you where you went wrong. So this is going to be um, Gen G versus DK. I agree with Hamalife beating KDF. I agree with that. I agree with that. T1 Hanma Life, I don't think T1 is going to lose. I think T1 is going to win, and it's going to be Genji T1 in the upper bracket. Where I do think that Genji T1 is probably going to go to like. It's probably going to be like five games. Then, obviously, in the lower bracket, it's going to be Damon versus, versus Hanma Life. Where Hanma Life will then upset. Hey, Cedral, really loving your content so far. Nice performance on Apex. Shame no. you only got third. Hope to see more variety content. Where where Hamalife will, will upset Take and, care, man. and actually lose to, to them. So it'll be Damon T1. Which T1 will then win and then Genji will trio. That's the that's the bracket. That's the bracket. How did the Apex go? Did you win? Did we win the Apex? You know what? Let me show you, chat. Did anyone watch the Apex last night? I'm guessing there's a few people who didn't. Let me give you a quick TLDR of what happened. Because I was re-watching it last night off-stream. So basically what happened was, we were tied for first place coming into the last map. We were tied. But because we're first place, the rule was that the last place team in the Apex tournament could choose what champs we play. They had to choose. So they gave us this dog shit comp, Crypto Vantage fucking Jibby. And I had to play Jibby, okay? They, they, the, and the worst part is, this dumb fuck over here, you know what he did at the start of the tournament? I flamed the last place team. I said they're dog shit. Tommy, you suck. I fucking I said they're trash. Okay? So I flamed them without knowing that there's a rule that at the end of the tournament, the last map, the first place team's champs get picked by the last place team. So they picked us a dog shit comp. Then it was actually going pretty well. We had like a nice building to hold. Then we made an insane rush because we were being pinned. I'm close to my Evo, so I might uh here. Well, I ulted them, I ulted them. We were being pilled, we were being pinned. There's one team outside our house, there's 10 squads left, they're still alive, so it's it's very tense, it's still, I crack one. 
Should we just push them? Or I cracked two, knocked two. Go in here, go in here, go in here, go in here. One team. Mirage that guy one, almost one dead. Nice. Mirage, one HP. Oh, Watson dead. knocked two kills. Nice. And then we're fine. We're right, fine. Chill. We retook the next base and we got a good set. We got a good ring. We got a good ring. We, we're fine. Okay. So I thought we were going to win this tournament. Yeah, we got a blood but then. Yeah. But then. But then the ring sucked. Look at that ring. You see it up there? You see it up here? See that ring? See that ring? See that? So we have to get here. So that means we have to run out in the open. We have to run out in the open. And of course, the team we're about to run into is the team with 13 kills right now, who's just fucking frying the whole lobby. Car, yeah. the car, of course, we're, we're the ones who run into them. We'll get shot. We're the ones who run into if them. If we get to take a lot of damage here, we throw the dome down, okay? Yeah. We just don't use it yet. People to our left, yeah. people to our left, I think. Yeah. There they are, right there. There they are, right there. I, I see them. I swing. Bang, 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 bang. Fried them. Go for the bat. Dropping the bat, one's knocked. The lifeline with the res. Lifeline abusers, cringe lords. Enemy team has one pro player and two others who are just playing protect the pro player. Controllers, oh, absolutely resi? out yeah. of control. I think fuck. I look. I see. I'm like fuck. Maybe I can drop the res. This is me. Died to the ring. I got knocked. Game's over. Okay. So we need to try and just dash into the just ring. Just try and run. Just try and run. I, I thought, it's okay. I it's okay. Seventh place. Seventh place. I'm done. I'm done. Do you think it's harder to win the LPL or LCK? Pog, let's go, man. I'm gonna say, I think it's harder. Bro, can you shut the fuck up? I think it's harder to win. <sighs> Mm, depends obviously what team you are, but I think LPL is harder to win because their format is complete psycho. There's so many teams. There's so many teams. And the format is brutal. And you only get double LM if you're top two. You have to fight through so many fucking teams. And people level up in those playoffs. So let's play this game shot then quickly. Eight minutes, not too bad. Are you smart? Apparently this one's actually really good. <laughs> Alright, apparently this one's actually good. Welcome back to another edition of Are You Smarter Than LCS Pro? This time, just C9, Blabber versus the rest of his team. And for those of you who don't know why we're doing this, Blabber smurfs every single trivia thing ever. So now we're gonna see if the rest of his team can beat him. How confident Ooh. are you guys feeling? <laughs> disgusting big ego in this trash. <laughs> First round, Projecting. LCS history. Each of these are worth a point. Blabber, send yourself up. Okay, we actually, right. we actually, can, win. We actually can win this one, right? All right. Put our hands somewhere? Yeah, hey, your hand has to be behind your back. In what LCS split did C9 win their first title? Sammy's 2018, right? 2016 spring. What? 2016. Ooh. Next up. 2016, bro. JoJo's such a zoomer. Former C9 jungler has also played for Team Impulse and KT Lister. Rush. Rush. Yep. I should wrap it up. I didn't know, man. All right. This C9 duo was nicknamed the Swole Bros. It's Golden Goose. Yes. Fuck. Oh, let's go. Hey. <laughs> we're back. We're back. Yeah, that's good. Let's go. Let's go. All right. At York, which York is fucked. tournament did Blabber's scuttle crab incident happen? MSI 2022 <laughs> or MSI 2021? 21. In MSI. Yes. Next round. LCS history. Who played in the first ever LCS finals? <laughs> any player, any player. No, TSM two teams. Versus uh, <laughs> I would be five CLG. <laughs> Can I get a hint? Are they still in the league? No. I can't? No. TSM and you are not getting the other team, but Team Impulse. No. TSM and GGU. Yes. Uh, what's it? Good game university. Alright. Yeah, let's go. 
Oh, you got things? No, you can, you can. <laughs> Come on, Max. <laughs> This current LCS org joined in 2017 after taking Immortals. C9 Challengers promoted. Black West. Yeah. Oh, close, 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 oh. close, 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 close. Nice try, nice try, nice try. I, I'm Sorry, old, I'm old. old. I don't have reaction. Blabbers <laughs> <laughs> up, blabbers yep. up. Okay, okay, I'm the ready. Details of the question. All right. Not including lock in, how many LCS titles Four. does Team Liquid have? I, I need to think. Wait. Four. Yep. Come on, yep. man. It was just the four in a row. Yeah, four in a row. All right. I don't walk every yeah, time. He has to get, he has to I'm crazy at this chat thing. <laughs> this Cold. world finalist top laner came to the LCS. Does impact in count? No. Bro, that's so easy. Just think old Wars, world yeah. player. Hey, hey, well, can't talk. Yeah, back to old Wars, right? But he's not a world finalist. Yeah. He's a world champion. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> sorry, sorry. World finalist. 2014. He came in 2014. Oh, th they're not still there, oh, right? Two names, because he's. Oh, it's Ackerman. Yeah. By the way, by the way. I still Wait. don't even know. This is the hardest Crazy. question in here. But well, you should have gave us the hint too, no? If Blabber ints, it goes back to you. Can you get it with the hint? You know it now. He was on LMQ, oh, right? Yeah. Okay, I'm ready. All right. Looper. Who you got? No. It was Ackerman or Godlike from Royal. Oh, oh, that's on LMQ. Looper didn't even win. Team. Yeah, that's why the world's finalist. That was the hard question. question. <laughs> Itemization. Who's Jojo, ready? Jojo, oh, you love items, Jojo. Jojo loves items. All right. What is the total cost of Frozen Heart? 2.4. 2,500. Yep. I actually would have gone up. I actually would have gone up. This AP assassin item had its price increased from 2,500 to 2,600. Yes. Nice. Okay, that's, good. that's an assassin okay. item? These are all worth two. Ready? What is the total cost of strike? 3.1. Right <laughs> Give me a second. <laughs> Like 3100. No. Yeah. Yeah. 3300. Yes. Fuck! Fuck! All right. This is for three points. So this is slightly larger. Oh my god, three points. Name the item components, individual component cost, recipe cost, and total cost. Of what? Energy. Don't press it. Don't press it. Kirsch's shard. Uh -huh. 700. Yep. Noon quiver. Yep. Noon quiver yep. and then uh, quiver jelly. Uh, 700, 1300, 600. Yep. 700 for Kirchner's shard. Let's go, man. 600 for the club. Yep. Recipe cost. Hello. Ah. No, 2.9. Go to 7. Yep. Ah. No! Great performance, Berserker. Final question. We get to reset because Yo, we need to give you... Yo, I don't build that shit item. I don't play that fucking trash role. Each laptop. 